all right i want to show you how to recover your username if you have been finding it difficult to log into some website just because you cannot remember your username i know there are countless websites that allow users to log in only with their username however if you can't remember your username you will not be able to gain access to your account i might lose everything in the account another reason why i want to make this video is because i've had some people asking questions when it comes to gaining access to their account so i want to use the website i have on my screen to demonstrate how you can recover your username so that you can gain instant access back to your account on any website it might be so right this website allow me to log in with a username or my email address but in case the website you are having challenges with doesn't allow you to log in with your email address then you have to go ahead and recover your username so how do you do that i want to show you one of the easiest things you can do to recover your username so right now what i will do now is i will go ahead and enter one of the usernames i know and i will try if i will be able to log in to the website so let's go ahead and do that i want to enter my username so i enter that and then i enter my password So I click enter, then I realize that either the username or the password is incorrect. By the way, I know that the password I entered is actually very correct. So the problem now is the username and I need to get the username for me to be able to log in. Fortunately, this website allow me to log in with email address. In case your own does not allow you to log in with email address, you can still use your email to recover your username. And this is only possible if you have access to your email address so for me i have access to my email address so i will go ahead and use my email address to recover my username so i will go straight right here and click on forgot password so immediately i click on forgot password i want to go ahead and enter my email address and i will use the email address to recover my username so i will go ahead and enter my email address i click on reset password and i want to see the next step so now the link to reset my password has been sent to the email address which means that this is the email address i used to register on this website so in case you have multiple email address what you have to do is to start entering each of the email addresses one after the other and request for your password so right now i want to go ahead and open my email address and see if the message actually come in so i'll go straight to gmail right here gmail.com so I want to go ahead and open that specific email address. So I open the email address. So now I can see that the email actually came through, which confirms that this is the email address I used to register on that website. So now I can see that the username has been sent to my email address. So the next thing I want to do is I can go back to the website and log in to my account. But if you can't remember the password, the next thing you should just do is go ahead and click on the link sent to you and recover your password so i will go ahead and click on the link right now i want to go ahead and change the password let's go ahead and enter the password right here then i have to confirm the password again then i click on change password so now that I click on change password, the password has been changed successfully. So I will go ahead and log into my account. So right now I've seen the username. I will go ahead and enter my password. I click on enter. And voila, I'm able to log into my account. So right, I'm in and then I can do whatever I want to do in this account. So that is just the simplest way you can go ahead and recover your username in case you forget your username. And the only option for you to be able to log into the website is with your username. So go ahead and use your email to recover your username and you'll be able to log in to your account. By the way, the website I'm using for this demonstration is basically for private labor, right? In case you want to get private labor digital products that you can sell as your own, you can actually do that right on this website and one of the beauties of this website is that you only need to register once and that will give you access to everything on the website forever which means that you are not paying yearly renewal fees or monthly renewal fees you only registered on the website once and you will be able to get access to everything on the website forever and as at the time of recording this video the actual membership fee is less than $50, which give you access to the website forever.
you are not paying monthly and you are not paying yearly so i will drop the link right for you to be able to gain access to the website by the way the link is my affiliate link and if you go ahead and purchase the membership i will get commission from your purchase and if you do that i will actually appreciate the fact that you use my affiliate link to register on your website so if you want to gain access to digital products that you can sell you can brand as your own go ahead and use this particular website by the way i hope you have been able to find solutions to the exact reason why you watch the video so if you have any question feel free to ask in the comment and i will answer your question thanks for watching and bye for now